This is my part one video of chapter number twenty, pictorial representation of data. Yes, students. What do you mean by pictorial representation of data? First, you must understand the meaning of data. The information collected in the form of numerical figures in a survey are known as data. When we present data in pictures, it is known as pictorial representation. As you present in pictures, it will be known as pictorial representation. And what do you mean by pictograph? Pictures that represent information are called pictographs. You will learn through some examples and sums. This one example: Following are the number of babies born in a hospital A, B, C, D, and E. In the month of January two thousand twelve, hospital A twenty one newborn babies. Hospital B fourteen, hospital C thirty five, hospital D seven, hospital E twenty eight. This is the numerical data. Now we have to present is in the form of pictograph. First we need learn all the numbers. It's not possible to make pictures thirty five, twenty eight, a large number. In that case, we must first find out a proper scale in which. These all number must be divisible by a common divisor. Observe the above data. The find all the given numbers are multiples of seven. So we use one symbol to represent seven babies. So in pins, the scale will be this is given in the bottom. One baby picture of baby represents seven babies. One picture will represent seven. It means when in hospital A, when you will represent. There are twenty one babies, and one represents seven. It means twenty one divided by seven. You will draw only three pictures. Hospital be fourteen, seven to the fourteen. In hospital, you will draw only two pictures. Hospital C thirty five, seven five the thirty five. It means you will draw five pictures. Hospital D seven seven one the seven. You will draw only one picture. Hospital E twenty eight. In this, you will draw twenty-eight uh, seven for the twenty-eight four pictures. There are some sums of your exercise sixty. Yes, students. Uh, now we need to learn. In this, we have to draw number of students using different mode of transport for going to school. These are the transport. Bicycle, car, bus, walking, scooter, and these are the figure forty-eight, thirty, seventy-two, eighteen, fifty-six is given. Now we are. This is not possible to draw forty-eight pictures, thirty, seventy-two pictures. For that, we take a common divisor. Six is all the numbers are divided by six. It means. So we will take the scale in this one picture represents six students for 48 you will draw 48 divided by 6 eight you will draw eight smileys here i have taken smiley you will draw eight uh, smileys if there are 30 number of students then 6 5 the 30 you will draw five pictures 72 divided by 6 gives 12 you will draw 12 pictures 18 divided by 6 Gives three. Even means you will draw three pictures. Fifty, fifty, four divided by six is equal to nine. It will give nine pictures. Now, number of students of a class using different soft scale. In this, different students using different brand of soap. Margot, Dove, Lux, Lyrill, Synthol, Margot. There are eighteen students. Dove nine, Lux twenty four, Lyrill twelve, and Synthol twenty one. This is given in the table. For this, first of all, we have taken the heading number of students of a class using different brand of soap. Now, what is the scale? One smiley represents three students, as all the numbers are divisible by three. For this, Margot eighteen divided by three. You will draw six pictures. For Dove, we will draw three pictures. Nine divided by three. For Lux, twenty-four divided by three. Eight pictures of smiley. Then twelve divided by three. Four four smileys. And twenty-one divided by three. Seven smileys. 
Now students, number 5. Number of cars of a particular model produced by a factory in the year 2006 to 2010. This is the given data. From 2006 to 2010, how many cars are produced in a, but in a factory? Then students first will write years from 2006 to 2010. In front of that number of cars as Numbers of cars in 2006, 25,000, in 2007, 40,000, in 2008, 45,000, 2009, 30,000, and in 2010, 35,000. Yes, students, what we have to do? First of all, these are the all the numbers in the, in the form of 1,000. It means all the numbers are divisible by 5,000. Instead of 5, we will take 5,000. When you divide 35,000 divided by 5,000, this will give you 7. It means every time it's divisible by 5,000, the scale will be of 1. I have taken here scale, 1 star. 1 star represents 5,000 cards. All the numbers are divisible by 5,000. In first, 7 will come. 40,000 divided by 5,000. 8 in 2007. 45,000 divided by 5,000. In 2008, nine, 9 stars banayenge. Then 30,000 divided by 5,000, 6 stars. In 2010, 35,000 divided by 5,000, means 7 stars. Each star represents 5,000 cars. Thank you and have a nice day.